Hello, everyone. I'm LW, and here we are in the Latch Bar studio. And we are about to conduct a Latch Bar daily workout demonstration so that you can see how to use the Latch Bar. The Latch Bar can be wall mounted, it also can be portable. So originally it starts off portable, and if you would like to wall mount your system to enhance your workout, it will allow you to do so. So here we have the deluxe wall mount system. Over here we have the basic wall mount system. And I am about to conduct a military press using resistance bands and of course the latch bar attachment system. Now you have to know how to use resistance bands properly in order to get the benefits that you are looking for. So you don't use resistance bands the same as you would use a set of weights. Resistance bands, you should move them slowly and also you should try and maintain resistance on the bands while you are conducting your exercise. So that means if you do a press, and if you want to do multiple press, never bring it all the way back down like this. Keep tension on the band, and I will demonstrate. And then take it back up again. So only bring it down partially, and then take it back up. And you will have continuous resistance on the resistance band while you conduct your exercise. Meaning you will get more benefit out of the exercise. Now, of course, if you want to make your exercise less difficult, then change the resistance band. Make it a lighter resistance band. These are medium extreme. So they will, they will give you a, more of a challenge in conducting your exercise. So there are other things that you could do while using this particular setup. First of all, you need to know I am not a doctor. So you should seek the doctors opinion or you should make sure that you get a physical before starting any exercise activity and also you should make sure that you never overdo it causing injury to yourself. Always keep that in mind. The website for the latch bar exercise system is www.lw500products.net. You can see more than 300 demonstration videos on YouTube and also on Instagram. More than 300. So, all you have to do is just log on and you'll be able to see all the videos that are there. Sorry, my dear, I can't talk to you at the moment. So we just did a press and then we did roll the boat. And these are just the beginning of the exercise that you can do 
using the latch bar exercise system. Let me just get my bench back in place. Okay, I will continue. All right, now, how about some crunches? These are pull down type crunches where you will utilize your abs to conduct this exercise. So you, you can pull down as much as you can using your arms and shoulders, but ultimately you have to use your stomach, your abs, in order to get you in the full exercise position. You want to crunch. You want to crunch everything so that you can minimize your body, basically. You want to crunch it so that you can feel the effect in your abdomen. And then we want to utilize the same bar and you want to do a side crunch. Yep side crunch. Hold the, the last bar down to your shoulders and touch your elbows onto the bench by bending from one side to another. How about that? That crunches everything in between. Slight discomfort from the beginning. After you get used to it, it's just like anything else. Something that you should have been doing a long time ago. How about that? You can also do, or what should I say is, we also include a pull down, pull down and hold it there. As you pull it down and hold it there, you'll notice the longer that you hold it, the more difficult it becomes. Slowly release it. Now, if you want to do multiple, maintain tension on the resistance band while you conduct your set. So I maintain resistance while I conducted the set of 20. You have some sidebar pulls over here. You kind of like those bars that are on a universal machine where you actually pull in like that. Well, welcome to the latch bar. Using the latch bar, you can be as creative as you want to be, almost duplicating practically any exercise that you did before.
And then while, while doing this exercise, maintain tension on the resistance bands. And let's move it back and forth. Very, very effective exercise for your shoulders, for your, for your arms, for your back also. You actually feel that in your wing muscle. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> you muscle guys, you know what it's called. Just, just kidding. You guys that work out all the time, you know what it's called. You know, one thing I'm not, don't claim to be. I am not a bodybuilder. I never wanted to be a bodybuilder. I always wanted to work out to be healthy. That's why I work out. And that's why I encourage you to work out. The last bar exercise system will allow you to work out without overdoing it. You can start off nice and slow and work your way up. Or stay at the same level, just continue to maintain and continue to exercise. It's a very comfortable workout system. I call it user friendly. It's not like at all lifting weights, but you get the same results if you work hard enough to achieve those benefits. So, your workout is entirely up to you, and the way that you work out is entirely up to you. But the system has capabilities beyond the normal resistance band workout. So using the attachments, it provides you with leverage, leverage that you do not have in a regular resistance band workout. This is a home resistance band workout system, and only the professionals would have a better system in their gym. But in your home gym, you would be able to do more than you could ever imagine with the latch bar system. And you don't have to save up for it like you have to save up for buying, let's say, a tunnel. Unless you got it like that, everybody don't have to save up. <laughs> but let's say this is a poor man's tone, that you can do even more with this system, with this resistance band system. It's not a machine. You do all the work. You will get all the benefits. That's right. Remember, in most cases, you're not as young as you used to be. Every day, we age another day. So we want to try and keep up with what we're able to do. And in most cases, we can't do what we were, what we were able to do years ago. But we're still able to, to do more than what we do. Because most of us don't do anything. And we need to get control of that. That's right. And the only way to get control of that is to do something about it. 
And you all can do something about it. We all can. We've all at one time done things that we never thought we could do, and you still can. That's right. Don't count yourself out. As long as you're able to, to get up out of your bed and walk and do things during the day just like you always did, but at a much slower pace, then you can do it. Because the only reason you're doing it at that slow pace is because you're out of shape. That's right. You're out of shape and you've been abusing yourself for many, many years. So now it's just time to start addressing some of that abuse. Trust me, nobody could abuse themselves more than I did. I know that's hard to believe, but Anyone can turn around and change their lifestyle. Anyone. All you have to have is willpower, a reason. Let's make sure that it's not a life and death reason, but just a motivational reason to make yourself healthy once again. You can make yourself more healthy than what you are but you'll have to put an effort into it. And I understand a lot of times effort scares most of us. Bad health should scare you worse than effort. You know how you all feel. It's not gonna get better, it's just gonna get worse. Trust me. You can make yourself feel good and look better. And as long as you look better and feel better, to you, that's what's important. But don't kick yourself. Because you will you will only be kidding yourself until you go to the doctor. Don't wait until the last minute to, to address your health. Address it while you can. Not when it becomes an emergency. When it comes, becomes an emergency, your health is in someone else's hands. Right now, you can put your health back into your own hands. I encourage you to do so. Trust me, you will feel better. You will look better. You'll be able to breathe better. That's right. You will actually boost your immune system. That's what working out does for you. And we all can do it. And of course, we'll have to clean up a lot of our bad health habits. 
when it comes to eating and snacking. We just have to do it. Address all angles and say, I'm going to do it. Because if you only go halfway, the benefits will be minimum. Minimum. That's right. Now let me introduce you to the latch bar sit-up method, where we use an entirely different method to sit up. We have a basic latch bar and it has four straps or two set of straps. One set is adjusted longer than the other set. The long set is adjusted for me to conduct sit-ups without the back pain or the neck pain. So conducting a latch bar sit-up, you will adjust your straps so that while you're lying, there is no slack in your strap. Once you apply tension to the latch bar, you can place it on your feet where it's most comfortable. My desired position is on the ball of my feet while I conduct this exercise. It varies from exercise to exercise. If you are attempting to hold the bar on the floor, it's best to place it where you have the most weight, usually mid-foot to the rear of your foot. So now we can use our strap with the grips and our arms and our abdomen to pull ourselves into a sit-up position. Makes it a lot easier, no stress on your back. You can all, all, also release yourself slower to minimize injury to your back when you're going backwards. So, no more of grabbing your head, no more of that stuff. And what's best about it, well, additionally, when you use this concept, it also acts like a spotter, as if someone is holding your ankles. Not immediately, but once you get used to doing it, it'll, you'll see what I mean. Usually what happens when you try and do a sit-up and you're all out of shape, your feet fly all up in the air when you're doing them. But when, once you get used to doing them, you'll be able to keep your feet down on the floor and, and enjoy that spotter in, in effect of the latch bar. So here you can see, as I conduct the sit-up, no stress to my back or neck in either direction. I am going to change up to the shorter strap set, and I'm going to bend my knees. I'm going to bend my knees so that I am going to sit up doing the crunching effect. So as I sit up, once again, I will lean forward to crunch my abdomen even more so than what you do when you're doing a sit up. The reason why you get more of a crunch is because your, your legs in the up position is restricting the movement of your abdomen so that you're able to crunch the bottom up, top down, all at the same time. How about that?
Now, these exercises are important. And I know a lot of us really don't like getting down on the floor. But always remember, when you get down on the floor, roll over <coughs> to get to your knees. Once you get to your knees, then you can stand up. It's much easier getting up that way. Let me have a sip of water. Pardon me. I guess my throat is getting a little dry from having to speak so much. Under normal circumstances, I would be parched either way because of my efforts. So, let me bring out my rolling bench here. Bench, my rolling bench. And I just want to loosen the old legs up, you know? Being an OG, you know, you got to loosen things up. So, we're going to loosen our legs up. benefits just like you would as if you were doing a squat. Because once you collapse your legs entirely, that's what you're doing when you're doing a squat. However, in this application, you're impacting your legs and a bit your shoulders because you're holding the latch bar in place. Because if you were at home, you would be using a bench. My rolling bench is homemade in my workshop. Along with everything else. So, we're going to use the same extreme setup and we're going to do some deadlift. Of course, you can add more tension, and of course you can subtract tension. You can double up your resistance band, or you can use a smaller resistance band. In 
It's up to you. However you'd like to conduct your exercise, that's how you do it. And you want to do some curls. Now we're using a deluxe round latch bar in order to do curls with a flat resistance band attached. We set this up because I wanted to do some curls while I was sitting. Call sitting and doing a curl. And we're making it more difficult based on the angle. And we can move back further to generate more tension, or you can just add more resistance. So the mini, mini warm out system with the basic latch bars can give you a full body workout just as well. Those of you that don't like doing sit-ups, this is kind of a sit-up alternative where you can where you can sit on a bench. and work your abs like this. The further you move back, the more tension, the more difficult it will be. up to the upper one. Where we have basic round and basic flat. And we have an extreme resistance band matched up with a flat resistance band. Tubular and fat, flat resistance. And what we do here is a pull For your bicep, shoulders, gadget here where we have a deluxe latch bar 
and we also have some resistance attached with some hand grips to stand on it. And now you could actually do regular curls. You can tell my left arm has an injury, but my right arm doesn't. And the left one is being rehabbed. So we'll get there. So the system is also very, very therapeutic. So when you pull a muscle or you break a bone or you have some type of replacement surgery, you always go to therapy and they always use resistance. Resistance is usually, usually very, very good while you're in the atmosphere, the office, where you're receiving the therapy. But when you go home, you'd like to continue. And the problem is, there's no attachment system when you go home. But there is now. The latch bar attachment system is here. That's right, it's here now. And you can use it for a number of different methods. So don't shortchange yourself, don't shortchange the system. The system is very, very powerful. And you would get a lot of benefits from this system. Just as I do. You don't have to stretch this to the maximum to get benefits. Just stretch it. Just do that. You will find, over time, you will find that your arms and everything else that you're working on will feel it. But don't overdo it. Don't overdo any exercise. Have fun doing exercise. You have fun doing exercise, and trust me, you can't go wrong. There you go. That's a good old expansion exercise there. Let me do a time check. We've got a few more that we can pull in. I like doing this exercise here. This is the basic latch bar with the pull attachment and also a semi squat attachment. Where you use the hand grips on one side like this. You place your feet on it so that you're literally standing on it. This way it doesn't move at all. Just do this exercise here. You'll find that it benefits you all the way up and down your legs, your thighs, your hamstrings, your glutes. And then, staying in the same position, just grab your other attachment. Do some pulls. Do some pulls and hold it there. Do more pulls. Pull slowly. Pull rapidly. It depends on what you're trying to accomplish. Because implementing the cardio effect is also good for you. Some say you're working out too fast, but that's not true. The cardio effect is important 
especially if you're looking to get excess off. Speaking of cardio, you can also do real cardio by jogging in place with resistance. There's a number of different methods. Here's one method of cardio where we use a flat resistance band around our waist and also a flat resistance band around our chest. As such, now you extend so that you have tension on the resistance band, top and bottom, lean forward, and it feels like someone is pulling you, pulling you backwards. So you're trying to run forward, but you're being pulled backwards. So, so make sure you're aware that you have to maintain your balance while you're doing this because safety is always first. So yes, you can do cardio, you can do it like this, or you can do it with the straps around your legs and around your arms, which is hanging on the other side over there, the red straps that you can see. So yeah, however you want to do your workout, using the latch bar system, you will enjoy it. There's nothing like it. Those resistance bands that you use to connect to a little bit of everything under the sun that you can think of, there's no more need for that. The last wire system got you covered. Turn your existing resistance bands and you can adapt them with this system into extreme resistance bands. Or just use them with the last wire system. They're compatible with, my system is compatible with all resistance bands. Even if you have to tie the resistance band onto the latch bar, you can still use the latch bar system. So it's up to you. The latch bar system can be seen on my website, www.lw500products.net. You can also see it on YouTube. You can see it on LinkedIn. You can see it on Twitter. You can see it on Facebook. You can see it on Instagram. You can see it on all these different platforms. In addition, you can see more than 300 videos on YouTube. My name on YouTube is The Latch Bar. You can see 300, more than 300 videos on Instagram. My name on Instagram is Latch Bar Workout. So, I'm trying to give you all of what you need, but you have to do the rest. That's right. My equipment starts from $20 to $1,000. You can buy individual components and get started tomorrow, or as soon as you receive the package. And you can watch the videos and get more information on how to use the equipment. Trust me, you will love it. You'll come back for more. Thank you all very much. Have a great night.